I was just thinking, have you guys ever wondered how to move forward and find empowerment after a challenging birth experience? In today's special mini episode, we're going to give you a little sneak peek into module six of our upcoming course, Reclaiming Your Birth Story. Get ready to discover how you can reclaim your power, setting the meaningful goals, and then prioritize self-care on your journey to healing. So stay tuned. The Golden Hour Birth Podcast, a podcast about real birth stories and creating connections through our shared experiences. Childbirth isn't just about the child. It's about the person who gave birth, their lives, their wisdom, and their empowerment. We're Liz and Natalie, the Golden Hour Birth Podcast, and we're here to laugh with you, cry with you, and hold space for you. Welcome to the Golden Hour Birth Podcast. I am your co-host, Liz. And I'm your co-host, Natalie. Um, Today, we had the pleasure of being a vendor for the third year in a row at Babies and Bumps. They have in-person events in St. Louis, um, Detroit, Columbus. There's Kansas City. There's Rochester. There's Cincinnati. So it's kind of all over the Midwest. It's a super great way to connect. Um, There's so many vendors who are so passionate from pregnancy and birth to postpartum, recovery, life with a baby. They'll like really help you tap into everything and everyone you need to know to help get to help navigate the road ahead. Um, they're yeah. so wonderful. Monica is the um, founder and the one who puts them all together, and she like is on top of it. Like she, she's amazing. Yeah. So it's really it's been a great three years. Yeah, we saw uh, prenatal yoga. There was. Um, one of our guests was there, uh, two of our guests, yeah. were with, um, pel- she's with pelvic floor therapist, and then Carly um, talking about birth, um, pain management options in birth. Mm-hmm. That was cool. And then always my favorite, uh, Jamie Grayson, who's <laughs> the best uh, CPST. He's so funny. I think I raved about him in one of our other episodes, <laughs> but he's just so genuine in his like love for helping moms um, and dads with their car seat safety. And he knows literally everything about every single piece of baby gear out there. He knows all the new car seats, um, just all the strollers, anything new. Um, he just he knows everything. and. I'm such a fangirl. Love it. So anyways, yeah. So today we have this uh, special mini episode for you. We're taking a break from our usual birth stories, um, like we've been doing a little bit, just to give you a sneak peek into our upcoming course, Reclaim Your Birth Story, which will be coming out very soon. Yeah. So in this episode, we're going to focus on module six of the course called, uh, our titled Cultivating Empowerment and Moving Forward. So this is the last module in our course. So, um, you know, if you ever want to go back, you can always go back to kind of highlight module one through five. Um, It's all about reclaiming your power and your identity as a woman, as a mother, a parent, and it sets goals for personal growth and creating a long-term self-care plan. Yeah. First, we talk about reclaiming your power and identity and about how your birth story is just one part of your journey and it doesn't define who you are. And I know we all get lost in motherhood um, and parenthood in that first, especially the first year. Uh, But yeah, so in this module, we'll help you embrace your strength and resilience that we've kind of brought out in the past modules and then, you know, recognize that you have the ability to shape your own narratives. So we'll be able to help guide you through an empowering reflection activity to just help you acknowledge your growth and the qualities that make you so unique. It's all about recognizing your worth beyond your birth experience. It's not just, it's not all of you. It's just one part of you. Yeah. And then we'll do some goal setting for personal growth. Um, You know, setting goals can provide kind of a sense of direction and purpose. As you move forward, um, it's always when you kind of get out of that fog of, oh, yeah, I am something more than, you know, a mother and you find time to be able to do things for yourself. 
um, setting goals is really a good plan because we kind of get out and we're like, what did I like before? What did what yeah. things that I used to do? What <laughs> I mean, no. I was a mom. <laughs> So, yeah, we go through kind of, um, you know, some exercises to help provide a sense of direction and a little bit of purpose as you move forward. And we teach you how to create smart goals. I'm sure everybody's heard that from from school or work, but that's, you know, specific, measurable, achievable, relevant and time bound goals. So by focusing on personal growth, you can just really create positive experiences in the future and cultivate a sense of empowerment. So module six really focuses on goal setting exercises to help you get started on your journey. Yeah. And then at the um, the last part of the module, we talk about the importance of creating long-term self-care plans. Self-care is our favorite. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> and it's just so vital for maintaining, a, you know, emotional well-being. It's not just a luxury anymore it is a necessity yeah so we'll be able to kind of just help you um, identify some self-care activities that bring you joy and relaxation and show them just how to integrate them into your daily and weekly monthly routines I know I love like being pampered so massages um, nails I like love doing that obviously it can cost some money. So I just try to really focus on like setting aside time, especially like during like, you know, Mother's Day and my birthday and things like that. So mm -hmm. um, it just really includes an activity that can help you create your own personalized self-care plan. Yeah. And speaking of massages, um, you know, our birthdays are coming up, Jerry. So you know, we love those massage gift cards. <laughs> Um, but by the end of module six, you'll hopefully, you know, we'll help you get through having the tools and strategies that you need to reclaim your power, set meaningful goals and prioritize your self-care. So that's just a taste of what the Reclaim Your Birth Story course has to offer. Yep. So if you're ready to take this next step in processing your birth story and finding peace and healing, Please just keep an eye out for the full course launch. We really just can't wait to guide you and be with you through this transformative journey. Yeah. So thank you so much for tuning in to this special mini episode of the Golden Hour Birth Podcast. We'll be back next week with more birth stories. And then we'll kind of be, be um, doing some more mini episodes as we release the course. And that'll focus more specifically on things that are in the course. So um, you will be hearing a lot about our course and it's so exciting for us to be putting it out. Yeah. So until then, just keep reclaiming your power and prioritizing self-care. We'll see you next week. Thank you for joining us on this episode of the Golden Hour Birth Podcast. We hope you've enjoyed our discussion and found it insightful and beneficial. Remember, the Golden Hour Birth Podcast is made possible by the support of listeners like you. If you appreciate the content we bring you each week, consider leaving us a review on your favorite podcast platform or sharing the show with your friends and family. Your support helps us reach more people and continue creating valuable episodes. If you have any questions, suggestions, or topics you'd like us to cover in future episodes, we'd love to hear from you. You can reach us on our website, www.goldenhourbirthpodcast or connect with us on social media. We value your feedback and want to make sure that we're delivering the content you want to hear. Before we sign off, we'd like to express our gratitude to our incredible guests who joined us today. We are honored that they trust us enough to be so open and vulnerable. We're grateful for their time and willingness to share their stories with us. If you're interested in taking the conversation further with us, join us on our Facebook group, The Golden Hour Birth Circle. We'll be back next week with another exciting episode, so be sure to tune in. Until then, stay golden and remember to take care of yourself. We'll catch you on the next episode of The Golden Hour Birth Podcast. Bye!